July 2018, former FMPD officer Adam Jobbers Miller spent a week at Lee Memorial Hospital after he was shot on duty. After family members asked for blood donations online... All of a sudden, there were hundreds of people lined up out the door. Uh, so yeah, we've not seen anything like that since 9-11. Unfortunately, Officer Jobbers Miller didn't make it. His family was so inspired by how many people wanted to donate blood, they decided a blood drive would be the perfect way to honor his memory. Not just with Adam, but any former fallen officer, uh, we make it a point to remember them and to make sure that they are remembered year in and year out because they were a part of our family. This will be the fourth year of the partnership between Lee Health and FMPD. Blood Center Supervisor Jeremy Puckett says it's the largest blood drive of the year. That blood that gets donated on those three days is going to go out and help people in on your community. It's going to help your neighbors, your family, your friends, anybody that's going to need blood. Uh, that blood will be here and available for them. The blood mobile will be out in front of Lee Memorial Hospital on the 19th and 20th and at FMPD headquarters on the 21st. I think he would be proud, obviously, and, and I think he'd be grateful for, for the support from the community because that's really what it is. It's the, the, the community supporting the community. While he may no longer be with us, Officer Jobbers Miller is still saving lives in the community he swore to protect. For Lee Health, I'm Devin Turk.